I am back for another review. I am just so excited, but boy, I can't wait for Sasa. Um, before I get over my head, um, I am Shauna for those who are new here. I am a perfume, I'm a frag head, I'm a junkie. I love olfactory, I love perfumes, I love everything fragrance. And uh, I have created this platform to reach out to my fellow frag heads. So welcome, welcome, welcome. I surely hope you love my content. And for those who are returning, thank you. My love on like cook food. Thank you for my little two subscribers. We see you, we love you, and continue to come back um and support my channel and ensure that if you have not already done so and if you choose to do so you hit that subscribe button you can also hit that like give a thumbs up um or a thumbs down every every feedback is good feedback i'll i'll appreciate it and ensure that you drop your scent of the day in the comment section yeah all right so guys i have been holding out am ready for talk about it now, it which is going to be spoken about is Ni Sha Ne Ani, right? So I have been so excited over on my Instagram page. Also, Insatiable Sense, you can check out my handle. I'll have it tagged below in the description box. Also, Insatiable Sense. Um, on my Instagram handle, I have been building up to this review. I'm just so excited to review it. I love, uh, let me not get over my head again. Let's start. All right. So, oh my God. So Nishane is a, the fragrance house Nishane. They are Turkish, um, Istanbul, and they are the first, I believe the first, fragrance host that was launched um in istanbul so they're already special um it is a niche perfume i <laughs> oh my gosh you see you see what i'm talking about my face is just going all over the place i am excited <laughs> i'm gonna show you what my packaged my packaged Nishane Annie perfume looks like. And I'm gonna do a mini unboxing just for you to get the luxury. It is luxury, it is fancy, it is expensive. <laughs> I actually copped this from TJ Fragrances over on Instagram. Safari has been a gem. He has the plug for your fragrance fixes. Um, you can also, Shout out to uh, Chun Sense. She is a staple, of course, in the fragrance supply community. Um, check on those guys. Let me just get into the meat of the matter. We want to start off. All right. So, yeah. Um, actually, on a little vacation now, and um, I have been trying this baby out for the past two days i had sampled it before so i knew that i loved it and i wanted it i got my sampled my sampled annie from the scented way ja check him out he has the plugs for all your designer niche oriental um fragrances he is in jamaica and he has the best customer service so i'll also tag his handle in the description box no this is the beauty which is annie it is as i mentioned from istanbul a the first niche fragrance house because most of the fragrance houses are in as you know france <laughs> france so it comes in this uh, there's a sleeve on it it is a extra de parfum so it is very potent it comes with a i believe this is somewhat of a bluish purplish sleeve on it gorgeous it is very 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 luxurious guys this is just really good and this is oops upside down so it looks like that right um it's attention to detail on the box you see this little uh engraving here it's pretty 
um the gold writing on the box as well i hope you can see it because i'm not even seeing what i'm doing right now i am trying to improve my video quality i hope this works <laughs> and if it don't work just watch the video and thumbs up all the same and you can see that it's an extra they perform at the bottom i hope you're seeing this lord help us and it is uh, extracted like this so that's what it looks like okay so you extract it and then this is the bottle in this little luxurious coffin sort of a setting oh geez <laughs> sorry guys so there's also a postcard that actually comes in it um let's get to the postcard first and here you can see the photo i'm not sure what that house is i'm sure it's something having to do with istanbul i have not really researched that part of it and i'm sure it has some sort of bearing on what the fragrance um, is trying to portray but i don't know so it has a note on it and this is a cute little card that it's you know the the perfumery sent over um this is what the bottle looks like luxury do you see the satin lining it's just oh and then the bottle pops out like that very gorgeous okay so if you are seeing the bottle i really hope you are it is heavy it's luxurious i love how rich and luxurious it looks there is a little the same i think it's an emblem of a horseman i'm not sure if you're gonna see it but it's pretty the cover has the Nishane um, on it. Uh, very, I would say an abstract, uh, irregular shaped lid. Very nice. Um, it sort of looks like a, like a cyclone, if you will. Um, it is gold and black, as you can see. And you have the Nishane um, in the middle of it. Very pretty. Very heavy as well. This can bust it. Yeah? This can bust it. And then this is the bottle, and ooh, we're just we're just excited like we can't bother with myself. We just can't bother with myself. Anyway, so all right, so this is the bottle. It's gorgeous. Um, so the juice it looks like a yellowish neon sort of thing, I believe. Um, take a quick look at the atomizer because you know a, a very good atomizer allows for better performance of the fragrance you know as it um goes onto your skin or clothing so this is the atomizer i hope you're able to see it very even very wide um good contact in love just so that you guys know from upfront in love all right so of course i wanted to do a proper detailed review so i took my time with it um I tried it in in hot, like a hot environment, um, a hassle-filled day. Um, it is very heavy. It's ex ex an extra the perfume, so it's very heavy. Um, in a hot day, I had it on my skin. It lasted seven, seven to eight hours in terms of longevity in a hot climate um and then but it was very overpowering um definitely i don't think it's supposed to be worn here if you're in jamaica and you really want to wear this fragrance i don't know if we wear it in the sun where you have a bun up it's gonna it's gonna suffocate you and the persons around you it's very strong very intense um and then i okay in terms of projection and siage very good projection for about four hours i would say maybe uh arm length or a little bit less than an arm length of projection for about uh eight hours sorry four to five hours and then it sits to the skin um a little bit closer to the skin after that point um in terms of sillage very good very good sillage um it is a compliment getter but let's 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 slow let's slow down a little bit i'm gonna take you into the notes so the manufacturer or 
the distributor has sent the notes on the card the um um what you call it again guys the card we have to envelope what you call it again postcard jason on the postcard so the top notes are bergamot green notes blue ginger pink pepper heart black currant turkish rose cardamom Woo! um base notes patchouli cedar wood vanilla benzoin ambergris musk and sandalwood no let me go on to what this smells like, how it develops um, before I get too excited and start around the other place, which must start already, but I'll spray it on the postcard. So in the opening notes, you have spicy, spicy citrus, zingy, almost spicy citrus, zingy. Um, you get some greenness initially on my Instagram handle or my Instagram platform. I Initial reviewed it to have little traces of green But after having the bottle and testing it and playing around with it. I do get some more of the green notes Very nice that cardamom comes out. You know cardamom is my baby love cardamom I do not get I think the pink pepper and the ginger and the bergamot does bring that heavy spicy zingy characteristic to the fragrance i don't get a lot of rose i do not get any turkish rose but i don't know it's just blended really well all right um so that zingy opening is there you get you get the burst of vanilla let me tell you vanilla start jump in your veins from the first spray you start get it very luxurious smell it feels like luxury it is a black tie event fragrance then in the middle now let me tell you about one at the middle now so the, of course that spicy zing is tapered by the black currant so it kind of rounds it you know in the middle love it love it love it love it love it so much so the black currant sort of gives it a little you know it, it tones that spice down a little bit as it travels down to the the base of the fragrance and then of course it starts to get creamy because i believe the sandal wood why the sandal wood starts to add that creamy gourmand element but that vanilla i don't it's i supposed to have in some amount of um benzoin right ambergris benzoin and musk so I don't get something very ambery. I am getting sweet, zingy vanilla cream, right? That's what it gives me, sweet, zingy vanilla cream. It is just masterfully blended, I kid you not. This fragrance, they spent some time on this one. The perfumer. Oh, she did spend some time on it. Mm. Oh, listen, this is just, this makes me want to get fancy, fancied up, dressed up, um, put on a uh, ballroom gown, some satin gloves, husband I got sat out with him, black tailored sexy suit um we're gonna go out we're gonna have some michael buble in the background playing nice little dance diamonds it's very opulent the decor uh chandeliers it takes me there it's not i wouldn't disrespect this fragrance and take it to work no i think this fragrance is for a formal setting a cold like you in a ballroom but it's well air conditioned nobody's sweating it's beautiful so the uh perfumer um cecile zarokian she this one was blended and released in 2019 so it's about what three years now i don't know why i did not try this before no i kept hearing wait let me tell you now a quick sub now so I have a friend whose name is Odin. I will. <laughs> I forgot to share Odin in the video because he laughed at me 
when I said that I found a sexy vanilla fragrance and I was actually referring to Kylie Vanilla 28. And Kylie Vanilla 28 is a really good vanilla fragrance, but not even a go girl on it. It's very gourmand, very sweet, very sugary, right? And when I said that that's the best um, vanilla fragrance that I had smelled, he said, what? Have you not tried any by Dishani? I'm like, really? I'm like, you need to try it. It is known as the best vanilla fragrance on the market. I'm like, what? <laughs> because I love vanilla in fragrances. Once missing the vanilla note per fragrance, I you know say it's gonna have some 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 character to the fragrance. It's just really nice. Very nice, very, very, very nice. So as I said, it is very it's a very good performer, very good um projector sillage is top notch especially if you wear it in sort of a colder environment it performs it does really well huge compliment ghetto um i i'm just in love with it you guys really have to try it it just it, it just says elegant classy black tie come on that's what it says to me um so definitely i will say it is worth the splurge so happy that i got actually a 100 ml bottle because if i had gotten a 50 ml bottle i would have probably very upset with myself but guys if you want to try this out you want to sample before you buy um for international persons go on twisted lily go on the sense pit go on um the sense gift go on fragrance here you go fragrance decant boutique there are many decant um avenues for those who are shopping overseas if it is that you are in jamaica check out the scented way ja as i mentioned the handle will be in the description box um if you want to try the fragrance after you if you want to buy the fragrance after you try it <laughs> then of course i'm going to encourage you to support safari jackson he is on Instagram. There are many suppliers, but let me tell you about Safari. Very reliable, very responsive, and his prices are competitive. Give him a hit up in his DMs. Um, if you choose to purchase this fragrance, it is gorgeous. All right, guys. So I have um, shared with you what my impression off and it is it is definitely a successful buy i'm very happy with it as i mentioned to you guys i'm on vacation and i've been playing with this all throughout the vacation it's really really good i'm happy with my purchase i also have put together a little mini blog a little mini teeny weeny blog for you to see what my journey has been on my vacation with this perfume what it make me feel like the vibe you'll get the vibes <laughs> when you see me i'm going with myself you'll get it so quick look and thank you for watching ensure that you hit like share subscribe so you can join my crazy family of olfactory idiots Yes, we're all idiots and we just, we can't help ourselves. So join guys, drop a comment, tell me what your sense of the day is. I'm so happy that you're able to join me. And until next time, bye. All right, you guys already know, I am from Jamaica, my beautiful island home. And this is what I do when I vacate, and see, joy, love, family. And of course, fragrance, reflection, time, sharing my moments with you guys. Love you guys. Let's, let's stay hey, loving you. So in keeping with Annie's elegant vibe, I decided to dress up um, for dinner where I would showcase my new fragrance. Big hit guys, huge compliment. Get her, I felt so beautiful. Of course you guys know that I love karaoke so I'm a come out, show up and show out. Yep. <laughs> but it was really, 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 really fun. Ah, enjoyed myself.
needless to say i enjoyed my vacation i'm so happy i was able to share it with you guys until next time we'll catch up see you